Raggles. Thank you. Happy to help, Rosie. Busy, busy, busy. Raggles? Raggles, what are you doing to the tutor? Oh, hi, Manny. I'm washing it for Rosie. You're being very helpful this morning, Raggles. Yes, Rosie. I am being very helpful, aren't I? Wow. Who is he talking to? Norm's a gnome. He rewards anyone who's been really good and helpful. Hmm. And I am being very good hmm. and helpful. Norm the Gnome? Look in my book if you don't believe me. Norm can appear at any time and reward anyone who is doing good deeds. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Bluebird, I'm Norm. Oh, you can laugh if you want, Manny, but I'm going to do good deeds all day long. And when Norm rewards me, you're all going to look very silly. Look out, Big Bear! The birds are back! Oh, not again! Shoo! Shoo! They're not even ripe yet. If we can just keep the birds off until tonight, the raspberries will ripen in this sunshine and taste delicious. I've got a good idea. Follow me, Will. Um, there. Now it's got a face. And here's <laughs> its hair. <laughs> Ta-da! We've made our bird scarer. Bird scarer? <laughs> Told you! You won't scare birds with that! Shoo! What you need is expertise. Proper equipment. And an eye for design. We'll make you a proper bird scarer, won't we, Manny? <laughs> oh, that's what I call a bird scarer. Thank you. This does look very, uh, scary. Oh, yes, Big Bear. It'll fool anyone. Good luck, Norm. <laughs> Big Bear! I've bought the jam jars! Oh! Hello, Rosie. Do you like my new bird scarer? That must be what Rackle saw. Big Bear, where did you get your bird scarer? Bluebird and Manny made it for me. But I don't think it's working. Don't oh, shoot! Shoot! It looks as though someone's been playing a joke on poor Raggles. Go on. Shoot! <laughs> looks like Bluebird and Manny's bird scarer doesn't work either. No, the only thing it did is fool Raggles. Maybe if we made the scarer look even more like Norm the Gnome, it would work better. Good idea, Holly. Let's take it to the studio. We'll be right back, Big Bear. Shoot. Bye, Rosie. Shoot. There. Now Big Bear can move it around. If this doesn't scare those birds, nothing will. Come on, let's try it out. 
Sure. Sure. Thank you for helping, Raggles. Mm, that's okay, Big Bear. Maybe Norm will come back if I carry on helping. Um, Raggles? About Norm. <coughs> that's funny. What's scaring the birds? Norm! Oh! One new Norm the Gnome bird scarer, Big Bear. A bird scarer? I knew that. Well, thanks, Rosie. Raggles? Did you really think it was Norm? Oh, of course not. Well, maybe for a minute. Norm the bird scarer really <laughs> works. It's time to get picking. More raspberries, anyone? Yes, please. Wow. Sorry we tricked you, Raggles. Oh, that's okay, Manny. Without Norm the Gnome, we wouldn't be having any raspberries. Three cheers for Norm. Hip, hip. Hooray! Oh, those colours. Oh, it's lovely. Rosie is so kind. And what about my first delivery as a postbird? Not bad, eh? I've got a picture for Rosie to say thanks. Wait there, please, Manny. Can you take it to Oakley's Hill? You can post it there. Post it? But what should I put it in? Um, do you have an old cardboard box, Holly? Um... <laughs> Oi! This is a post box, not a trampoline! How does that feel? <laughs> Comfy? A little tickly on the old bark. <laughs> but I'm so excited, I don't mind. Here come your first pieces of post. Oh, hi, Holly. <laughs> oh, who are they for? Can't you guess, Oakley? Let's see. Rosie, Big Bear, Will, Bluebird, Raggles. Yes. Oh, mustn't forget these. We can't post letters without stamps. Good thinking, Holly. Time for my deliveries. Thanks, Oakley. Thanks, Oakley. I love sending things to my friends. It's even more fun than receiving them. Oh, glad to be of service. Oh, I can't wait for my first letter. What's going on here? Letter for you! Oh. Manny's delivering the post, Bluebird. He's our first ever post bird. What? But I'm much better at flying than him. I'd be a much better post bird. Oh, this will look so pretty. Beep, beep, beep. Out of the way, Holly. Post box coming through. <laughs> That's really good, Will. Yep. Now, let's see who gets more letters, you or me. It depends how many letters you send, Will. <laughs> fly! Fly! Fly, plane! <laughs> oh, dear. Poor Raggles. I'm busy making a post box, otherwise I'd help. I don't need any help. Shame it can't flap its wings, really. Fly! 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 Oh, hello, Manny. Looks like I've got my post box ready just in time. There you go, Big Bear. Well, if anyone's a post bird, it should be me. Excuse me? It was my idea. Oakley had the idea too. Hey, you two. The important thing is everyone gets their post safely. And quickly. And I'm a lot faster than you'll ever be. Let's see, shall we? Last one to Teal's nest is a feather duster. I did 
did it. I got there first. You did not. Tell him, Teal. Never mind that. You squashed my post box. Excuse me. Some of us have urgent post duties to carry out. No. I get so many visitors now on a post box tree. <laughs> I think your post box is about to get quite heavy, Oakley. Oh, I don't mind. I just want everyone to get their post safe and sound. I'm going to get so many letters. Me too. Well done, Oakley. This is the best idea ever. <sighs> Hey, you can't take them all. I want to deliver some. They're mine. Go and clean something, you big feather duster. Oh, no posty, no posty, posty. Posty. Oakley, Oakley not, not happy. happy. <gasps> We've forgotten Oakley. This was his idea, but we haven't sent him any letters. Don't worry, we will. What are we going to do, Rosie? Can you fetch some paper and crayons, please, Holly? <laughs> Don't forget the stamps! Ready? One, two, three! Shops away! Ooh. Ooh, what's this? <laughs> Post for me? And this one's from Big Bear. I've never had post before. Would you help me send thank you letters, Holly? Of course. You're the best post box tree ever. <laughs> <laughs> to see if you need anything and to give you these. Oh, seed biscuits are my favourite. I've got everything I need, thank you, Rosie. Extra soft nest, tasty snacks for me, delicious duckweed for the ducklings when they hatch. Duckweed! What's the matter, Teal? Duckweed! I've forgotten the duckweed! I was so busy getting the nest ready, I forgot. We'll get you some, Teal. Um, what does it look like? That's just it, Raggles. Only ducks know how to find duckweed. Oh, what shall I do? I can't leave my eggs to get cold, but my ducklings must have their duckweed. We could look after your eggs while you go and get the duckweed. Would you? Oh, I don't know. Do you promise to take really good care of them? We will. We just need to find something warm to cover them, don't we, Raggles? Something soft and fluffy and cosy. Well done, Raggles. You'd be perfect. Me? Do you think he can do it, Rosie? Egg sitting's not easy. Of course he can. Can't you, Raggles? Oh, careful. Oh, not like that. Uh, a bit to the left. No, right. No, left. Slowly. <gasps> That's it. Well done, Raggles. I'll be back as soon as I can. Hey, it's really comfy in here. I like egg sitting. Ooh. <laughs> Rosie, <laughs> something feels funny. <laughs> Are you all right, Raggles? <laughs> That's tickling me. <laughs> Don't bounce, Raggles. You'll hurt the eggs. It's not me, Rosie. <gasps> Look! They're hatching! <laughs> oh. Oh. I thought Teal was supposed to be here for the hatching part. I'll go and find her. You look after the ducklings till we get back. Uh, okay. I'm not your mama. Stay there and I'll get you some seed biscuit. <laughs> They're copying me. How about this? Wow. They love me. Rex! 
Bubbles, what are you doing here? I thought the ducklings would be cosier here at home. But this is your home, Raggles, not theirs. That's okay. They love it here, Rosie. Look. <coughs> they think you're their mummy. <laughs> and I've taught them loads of really important stuff already. Look. <coughs> I'm looking after them really well But they've got to learn how to be a duck From their real mummy Yes, but what about swimming? Oakley said Teal has to teach them how to swim I'll teach them It'll be a lovely surprise for Teal when she gets back I'm not sure that's such a good idea, Raggles Raggles? These bits are really tender. Oh, they'll love these. Oh, a teal. Oh, thank goodness I found you. Your eggs, they've hatched. They have? Oh, where are my lovely babies? Don't worry. Rosie and Raggles are looking after them until you get back. In we go. And then, just do the rabbity puddle. Copying me. Ducklings don't have arms, Raggles. They don't swim like you. My new ducklings! <laughs> Thank you for looking after them. Come on, lovelies. Let's get home to the stream. Come on. Why aren't they coming? They think they're rabbits, like Raggles. <gasps> oh. Maybe if Raggles hides, They'll come with you, Teal. Come with Mummy Lovelies. I don't know who I am. Ah, can't steal. So much for my hatching outfit. Me? Oh, I'm not your mama. It's your new tail, Bluebird. It looks just like Raggle's ears. Of course. Teal, I've got a plan. They're swimming. Oops. My lovelies. <laughs> I hope you don't miss the ducklings too much, Raggles. Teal's a duck. She knows a lot of special duck things. But there is one thing I can do that she can't. The Raggles wriggle! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Um, why not start with the things that won't wobble? Wow, you're good at this, Rosie. Thanks. Can you show me again? Nice try, Raggles. You have to do it. I'm helping Holly. See you later. <sighs> <laughs> Sorry I'm late. Shh. The yellow, please, Rosie. I'm mixing all the different colours together to make a brand new colour. No, the pink. Oh, no, no, the red. Oh. If I mix in this red, it'll change the colour and... <gasps> That's it! That's a pretty colour. Not just pretty, Rosie. It's the perfect purpley pink. My favourite colour ever. I call it... Um... Oh, I know. 
the plink. <laughs> oh. What's wrong, Holly? I love my plink, but how am I going to remember which colours I used to make it? What was that clicking sound? I'll go and see. <laughs> Hi, Big Bear. Are you all right? I've got a little problem in my garden, Rosie. Quite a big problem, really. Maybe I can help. Show me. It's my grapevine. It's getting so big it's blocking out the sunlight. Hmm. You should prune it, Big Bear. Oh, but I like my vine. Perhaps you could tie it back instead. Oh, great idea, Rosie. Hmm, what was that clicking sound? I don't know. Ah! Oh, sorry, Rosie. Oh, let's get you cleaned up. <laughs> Yay, another great shot. Gooey! Will's putting on a photo show on Oakley's Hill. Don't miss it. Uh-oh. <laughs> see these photos. What are they photos of, Will? You'll see. Here goes. <gasps> oh. I'm covered in paint. And I'm all muddy. I didn't know you took my picture. Neither did I. I look silly. Me too. <laughs> and that is Definitely not my best side. All I did was take your photos. You should have told everyone what you were doing. Rosie's right, Will. You should have asked us before taking our photos. <sighs> All right. I'll ask from now on. Me first. Want to see my best smile? So I'll never forget how to make my plink. And that's you in your favourite vine, Big Bear. Oh, so I'll always remember how it looked, even though I've pruned it now. Oh. <laughs> and that's my nest on its proper branch. If it falls out again, you'll know where it goes. Hey, you looked out! <laughs> <laughs> Yes! Now I'll always know where everything goes. Come on, who's for a game? Oh, yay! Action shot! <laughs> <laughs> Looking for something, Raggles? Dinosaur footprints. And some of them fly, too. Have you seen one of these? Oh, certainly not. Who's that? A pterodactyl. It's a prehistoric bird. Ooh, I don't like the look of him at all. Where are his feathers? Let's see him race me. He hasn't got a chance. Come on, Ruggles. I need you on the seesaw. Sorry, Will. I'm hunting for dinosaurs. You're hunting for what? Dinosaurs. Now, everyone, please be quiet. I don't want them to know I'm coming. <laughs> That's the funniest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> What's funny? There are no dinosaurs anymore. <laughs> they all disappeared millions of years ago. What? It's true. There have been no dinosaurs for a long, long time. <laughs> Even before I was an acorn. Hmm. We may not be able to find a live dinosaur, but we can still hunt for dinosaur bones! Oh! It's... it's... a... a... a, a dinosaur bone! Wow! No way! Wriggles, you've done it! Let's go and tell everyone! 
Um, Raggles? <gasps> Bluebird, you'll never believe what we found! I've never seen anything that's older than me before. You can touch it if you like. Ooh. Raggles, Will told us about the dinosaur bone. Can we see it? I want you to see it properly. What do you mean? Be amazed, but don't be late. Come and visit Raggle's Dinosaur Museum. <gasps> wow. This bone lay in the earth for thousands, no, millions of years until I, Raggle's, dug it up. Wow. <gasps> yes, and it probably belonged to one of these. Oh. <gasps> no, actually... This really humongous one. <laughs> Big Bear, you must be so excited. The bone came from your garden. Um, oh, but, oh, it's not a dinosaur bone at all, Rosie. What? I don't know how to tell Raggles the truth. I don't want to disappoint him. Oh. Uh oh, I'm sorry, Raggles. The thing you found, it's just the handle of my old spade. Ah! <clears throat> I knew it wasn't real all along. Never mind, Raggles. It may not be a real dinosaur bone, but you shouldn't stop looking. Raggles, there you are. <laughs> Whoa! What's going on? <laughs> Wait, you two! <sighs> oh, those disguises aren't bad. Nearly as good as mine. But aren't you cross that we surprised you? Cross? All I've wanted all day is for us to have some fun together. Hi, Karamba! What kind of fun? Um, I've got a game you could play. Raggles, are you ready for a dinosaur hunt? The trees are ready, Rosie. Well done, Holly. Dinosaurs, get set, go! <laughs> Uh -huh. This looks like dinosaur territory. <laughs> Yay! Spotted one! <laughs> okay, but the next one's mine. <laughs> oh, whoa! Major dino alert! <laughs> <laughs> I spotted them all, the fastest and the fiercest dinosaurs in the land. <laughs> well done, Raggles. <sighs> I definitely make a better dinosaur hunter than you, Rosie. I'm quicker, sharper eyed, I'm a bit quieter than you for creeping up on things. <laughs> Watch out for the Rosiesaurus, Raggles. <laughs> to beat you! Oh, no, you're not! I won! I'm king of the hill! <laughs> but you didn't win, Will. It was a tie. Oh, yes! King of the whole garden! Well, in that case, I'm queen of the garden. 
<laughs> I don't think so. There can be a king and a queen, you know. Isn't that right, Big Bear? Yep. In lots of Holly's books, there's both. Uh, okay then. But I'm in charge. It's not all about being in charge, Will. If you're king or queen, you have to work together, look after everyone and make them happy. Oh. Well, what else do kings and queens do then? Um... Oh, queens are good at baking tarts, like the Queen of Hearts. <laughs> I can bake too. And kings are good at riding horses. Queens can do that too. After all, I'm very good at riding my Twitter. I know something that both kings and queens do. They live in big, big houses called castles. Ooh, a, a castle. castle! I'm going to make one, and then I'll definitely rule the garden. Ahem. I'll build my own castle, and everyone can come to visit me whenever they like. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Too much noise. Some of us are trying to have a nap. Whoops. Sorry, Bluebird. I'm the king. I don't have to be quiet. <laughs> Well, I'm obviously not going to get a snooze in this noisy kingdom. Hmm. What I need is a nice, quiet tower, just like Rapunzel's. I'll go and find one. A flag! Every castle has a flag. Come on, to the maze! <laughs> Make way for the king! <sighs> <sighs> It looks like there'll be no peace and quiet here, either. What do you think, King Will? Nope. This isn't good enough for a castle fit for a king. Oh. Oh. Beavers! The perfect builders! Hey, Matt and Nat! Would you like to help build the biggest, bestest castle in the kingdom? Oh, oh yes, 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 yes. Building, Building is, is what, what we, we do best. best. Come on, then. Let's go! Oh, where to this time? Hmm. Somewhere hidden. Somewhere protected. <gasps> the maze! Ah, peace and quiet at last. Now for my beauty sleep. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Why don't I feel sleepy? This is it. The perfect spot for a king to build his castle. Hey, I found it first. Didn't I, Raggles? Um, I think you both found it at the same time. You'll just have to find another spot for your castle, Queen Rosie. No. I think you'll have to find somewhere else for your castle, King Will. <laughs> Can't you build it together? No. Hmm. Maybe we could build half each. OK. And the best half will rule everyone in the garden. <sighs> they may have been noisy, but it's not quite the same without the others. <laughs> Maybe I'll go and take a sneaky peek and see what they're up to. Trapped. 
a real damsel in distress, just like Rapunzel. Oh. Who will save a poor trapped princess? Uh, um, I, I mean Bluebird. I'll, I'll save, save you, Bluebird. Bluebird. This is hopeless. We need to work together. Okay, it's a truce. Stay right there, Bluebird. Ah! We'll save you. playing outside. Me too. But we just have to make the best of it until the rain stops. One, two, three. What are you doing, Holly? It's Big Bear's big baking day today. He'll need his baking tray back. I borrowed it, but I can't find it anywhere. <gasps> it stopped raining! We can go outside! Hey! Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> <laughs> wow! A rainbow! It's beautiful! All those colours! Red, orange, yellow! Green, blue, and, and what are the other ones? Indigo and violet. I knew that. I've heard that there's a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. A pot of gold? Wow! I'm going to find it. Me too! You know, sometimes the search can be as rewarding as the discovery. Look! The end of the rainbow is at the playground! Now, let's find this gold! I'm going to see if I can find Big Bear's baking tray. I think I'll go and see if Big Bear needs any help. Nearly there. Oh, this is going to be amazing. What should we do with all the gold? We could make gold crowns. Or we could just count it. Or pretend to be pirates with our own treasure chest. All we have to do is... Huh? Where did the end of the rainbow go? It was just here. There it is. <laughs> After it. Finally, the end of the rainbow. And the pot of gold. Eh? I don't understand. It was just here. Oh, now it's back over there. Come on, before it moves again. Right, this time we're definitely going to... Huh? Well, it's gone again. We're never going to find it at this rate. Perhaps Holly might know more about it. We could ask her. I'm sorry, I don't know how to find the end of the rainbow. Hmm. <sighs> I heard the story about the pot of gold from Big Bear. Perhaps you could ask him. That's a good idea. <sighs> if you're going... Please, could you get that down and give it to him? Of course. <sighs> Bye, Big Bear. This is from Holly. Thanks, Raggles. I'll need this for my big baking day, as well as a lot more apples. Holly says you know all about the pot of gold at the end of a rainbow. Is that right? Well, yes, but I... Uh, I don't really know about finding it. Oh. I heard all about it from Rosie. Perhaps you could ask her. 
Would you like us to help you pick some apples first? Yes, please. Thanks. Good luck. The pot of gold at the end of the rainbow? Yes, you must know. Please say you do. I'm sorry. I don't actually know how to find it. I just heard the story from Bluebird. Oh, I guess we'll have to ask her. Would you like us to take that to Big Bear on our way? Oh, yes, please. <laughs> Let's hope Bluebird knows. Thank you. Now I can really get cracking with my big baking day. There's Bluebird. Wow! Come here. I said come here. Oh, not again. We'll help. There you go. Thank you. Bluebird, Rosie says that you know about the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Well, I do, but only... <sighs> Let me guess. You don't know how to find it, only that someone told you it's there. That's right. Okay, told me. Come on, the rainbow is fading away. Oakley. We've been searching all day for the end of the rainbow. To find the pot of gold. We've asked everyone we know. And they say that you know all about it. Please say <laughs> you do. Oh, yes, that story. I've known about it since I was a sapling. <gasps> yes. yes! And I'm sorry to say that the end of a rainbow, where the pot of gold is meant to be, is always just out of reach. But it can't be. No matter how much you chase after it, it's always just a bit further away. That's right. And now the rainbow's gone. Oh, we might as well go back to the playhouse. We're never going to find that pot of gold. I'm sorry. Come quickly. Well done. You found the pot of gold. But Oakley said the pot couldn't be found. And the rainbow is gone now. Yes, but it <laughs> seems to have left something behind. Oh, wow! wow. wow. Uh -oh. <laughs> you tried so hard to find the pot of gold, so we thought we'd make one for you. And as you two helped all of us to make the apple pies, you now get to help us <laughs> eat them. Oh, yeah! Oh, this is even better than real gold. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>